I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on her. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You got to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse, like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, they'll sink their teeth in the I saw a somebody. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. around that's weird Hey guys, this is JDD and welcome to Resident Evil 2. Now, I know that this game has been out for a couple of years now, but uh, I felt like a horror game and I was flipping through my library and stuff and I found Resident Evil 2, so I said, why not? Now, it's been a long time since I've played this, so uh, I remember when it first came out, I used to play it every single chance I had. I played the hell out of this game. Um, Hello? So yeah. Anybody this... there? Hmm. Something's not right. It's probably the, the, my favorite chapter of this MP. <laughs> Is you all right? Remake, I think, is the best one. Don't move. Oh, no. I'll be back for you. Even better than village, I believe. Stop moving. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got this. Hey! I'll shoot! Easy peasy. Okay, so I need to remember my way. 
So, thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. They'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Welcome to Raccoon City. Now I believe this game takes part just after uh, Resident Evil 3. The, in my opinion, this is far better than the 3. Like in Resident Evil 3 Remake, they left out the clock tower police station we only see a very small part of it why is this and this one police station it basically takes place in police station most of the time like 80 percent of the games in the police station attention all citizens due to the citywide outbreak you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. The police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Like we're walking from here. More like running. Yeah, good call. Whoa! 
Claire! Claire, are you okay? Yeah! I'm alright! How about you? I can't stay here, it's not safe! Go on ahead! I'll meet you at the station! I'll be there! Okay, so this is out of control. Is Let me just um, reduce the audio, but uh, I think that's fine. Yes, okay. Every time the game, not to go. Okay, so we have to make our way to the police station. We should be able to take this alleyway here. Shit! It's everybody. They've all turned. I'm pretty confident I remember. Um, pretty there much. it is. The station. The layout of the station? I remember playing this game. Okay. We've made our way safely to the police station. Oh man, here it is. This brings a lot of memories. Huh? Okay, some bullets to start off with. find these three medallions and then we go underneath the station yeah I'm pretty sure we can dodge this guy by staying here exactly. now we have to back back to where we came from which is this way Jesus! They're everywhere! Nice! I still remember that. Okay, cool.
Okay. Okay. You're safe. For now. Thanks. Marvin Brana. Leon Kennedy. There was another off strike. I couldn't. I couldn't. Here. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Mm. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie! You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out. Or you run. Got it? Got it. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this is basically where the game starts. Um, now, I am... I have a, a really good idea of my whereabouts and the layout and everything. So I'm not gonna pick up each and every item. I don't know how long this video would be, I guess. Maybe until I die? I'll... We'll take it by replay by you. not how I imagined my first day. Okay, let me get rid of this key. Okay, we got a map. Up we go from here. Broken window. There should be ammo here, I guess. Okay, so there is a safe here, which I believe is the 
combination is 9, 15, and 7. Operations reports. Hang on, I think. Yeah. Initially, you find a lot of demos, so demos is not a problem. And we have to unlock desk. So this should be uh, an idea, I believe. Yep. Yeah. Well, basically, um. You need to find the first letter of the names on the left, on the right. Is it left? Right. So basically, N, E, and D, and the same for the other side, which is, uh, I believe, M, R, G. Yep. have found a high capacity clip that goes with our Matilda. Now there should be another safe uh, later on in the game. We'll find another safe that should give us a silencer. Okay. That door is locked for now, so I have to pack that. Son of a bitch! Nice! Okay, so up to the third floor immediately here. We should find some ammo here. Yep. There is a locker which you can open. The code is DCM. And you find. Uh, okay, the magnum shots. Magnum rounds. Okay. Here we should find the first key, which is the spade key. Go down again. We've pretty much cleared the way up to now, so. Just do a pit stop here to clear my inventory. Yeah, as I said, like, um, ammo is not a problem in this game. So remove that, remove that, remove that. Now that we have a key, we should go back here. Use the key here. This will put us back into the reception area. There you are. Come here. Take a look. Yes. I knew she'd make it. Oh, you know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard through the second floor. 
He saw it. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. <laughs> okay, so... There should be another safe in the first room up here. Which will give us the silencer for the metal. And the code to the safe should be six left, two right, eleven left. Yep. Cool. Now there should be a fourth part, well, a third part you will find for the motel that for third upgrade. And it is much later on in the game. I believe we should go in here. Yeah, we find the key card. We will come back in that room later on. I'll be right there. Okay. Claire. It's so nice to see you. How are you doing? That helicopter just came out yeah. of nowhere. I'm in one piece. I'm guessing you don't have a key in one of those fancy pockets? Uh, unfortunately, no. Mm. But how are you doing? You know... Just surviving. That's good. Yeah. Any luck with your brother? No, not yet. Claire, don't lose hope. I'm sure we're gonna find him. Damn it. You know what that means? Yeah. Dinner time. Claire, I think you should go. Don't worry about me, Leon. You take care of yourself. Yeah, you need to go. Now! Okay. Let's get through this. Both of us. Okay, uh, Marvin, so... I've got a situation here. I'm surrounded by zombies. Marvin, do you copy? Marvin! Damn it! Okay, so here we find the bolt cutter. I think there's three doors you need to use the bolt cutter on. This is number one. This is number two. Yellow gunpowder will mix it um, to get some shotgun shells. Easy peasy. So, let me drop some items. Uh, actually, can get rid of the flash grenade for now. All the rest, I think we need. Or maybe. Yeah. 
Okay, so we're going back now. Now, remember, there were a few broken windows which we didn't barricade, so. We need to be careful here. Go am I? This is where we use the bolt cutter for the last time in the game. We'll dispose of it. There's some inventory space, we got the electronic gadget. This is the cap is the code for the locker I will find um, very soon in level 2, door 2 now we can actually go inside here I believe we can operate locker 109 yep This is where we got the shotgun, guys. Nice, nice. So now... I mean, you can come back and... and, and open these lockers when you find... Once you find the keys for them, because there's two keys missing. I believe we can open 106, which uh, has a film, which we don't need. So, this area is pretty much cleared up. So now we need to go to level 2. Is this level yeah, second floor. This is... Uh, Okay, these mini safes, once you open them, then you get um, the keys for, for the storage room down there. You don't need them. Keep it up. Shotgun shells. This is where we will use the CAP code. More of them shells, we're not gonna open this one because a zombie will fall out. This guy won't do any harm. Gunpowder. Empty locker. Shotgun shells. Here is where we find the first liquor, guys. It's just a... Uh, won't do any harm, won't attack. It's just an animation. We'll combine this with this. Uh, more shotties here. Found the battery for the detonator. Nice. This is the document where you see the 957 there. That's the code for the first safe that we've opened. Now we have to come back here later on in the game in order to get the magnum. Also, there is a secret compartment which you can't open now. This is Wesker's desk. And uh, the third drawer down there, the big one, later on in the game, should be available to open. Now we have to backtrack. up to 
to the third floor. Go to here. Go to here. To find some more gunpowder. Now. That guy. Okay, that's a later on. Now you need to, just a small trick, you need to get out of the room, get back in. This way, this, um, this shelf, bookshelf, doesn't fall and here is where we find our first medallion so this should be there it is Now there is a liquor spawn here. Shit. Okay, he won't follow us obviously. And now we're in the library. We still find our head, okay. Now it's I believe Three zombies here that we need to take care of. That was a waste of ammo. Should decapitate this guy. We get the book. Go through this door. Get the map. And get the second medallion. Which I believe is. Scorpio appearance. Yep. Hey. So, um, this is the last time we're going to use the key. Okay, so, up to now, two medallions. Look at the amount of ammo we have. This. Remember, we have 58 in the in storage. Third medallion over here.
There you go. Done deal. So it goes underground. Huh. That's it. That's our way out. Lieutenant Brana! Marvin! It's time to go. Hey, Marvin. <laughs> we need to get you to a hospital right now. No, no, I... Uh, save yourself. Come on, I've got you. No! Look, we can still make it out of here together. Just can... It's too late. I tried, Leon. But I couldn't stop it. We can't let this thing spread. It's on you now. Just go! I understand. Obviously, he will eventually turn. We'll meet him again. I believe next time you see him, he's gonna be at Zombie. I won't let you down, Marvin. Okay, so we're about to face the first boss in this game, guys. Let me just um, remove some items. We need our handgun ammo. Mm, that's it, I guess. Okay, so... There should be a hand grenade down here. Yep. Was 
wasn't supposed to lose the hand grenade right there, but no. We should have done better though. Like somebody's watching. Okay. I saw some herbs. I believe there's more ammo on the other side. Down here, I believe. Okay, so health restored to the max. We got a hand grenade back. Yeah, it's a pity we used the hand grenade. But I didn't have a knife, so because we lost the knife to that to that policeman, the, the police station. Should have grabbed another knife from the library though, but I forgot to do so. Both of these lockers are empty, so I don't need a herd, right? Okay, so off we go to the parking lot now. More inventory space. Uh, remove that. Ooh, shall I remove the gunpowder? I feel I shouldn't. So off we go. From now onwards, basically, we're gonna use the shotgun. Huh? Key card. You gotta be kidding me. Get off of me! Hey! Who is that? Ada Wong, Stay baby. sharp. Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Thank you. For your help. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Okay. Hey! I'm not done talking to you! So this is where we get the map. More bullets. 
This is the prison, by the way. And this is where we meet Mr. X for the first time. There's a cutscene here. Hello? Hey. I don't believe it. A real human. <laughs> Hello, human. You've been here long? Long enough. Are we the last ones alive? No. No, there's a few of us. Huh. That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's, of course, Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. Hey, I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage, believe me! Sorry, I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in this station. So either we play nice and help each other out, Coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on, don't be an asshole. Okay, you need this. Just get me the fuck out of here. Yeah. Still has the boss, huh? Who is that? It's just me. So you can put that thing away. I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? No. You knew him? He was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. So what he said was true? Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out, Leon. Before it's too late. Then we'll talk. You. Name's Ada. Ada. Well, I guess the deal's on. Okay, so we have to restore power in order to open the cell. There's a document about the jail power panel, which is broken. So we have to leave this area for now. Restoring the power is not that easy. It takes quite a lot of um, running around. First of all, we go to the cannons and more and shooting range. Okay, this is um, let's examine this box. We open it, we'll find that car key, police car key. In the boot of that cart, you'll find the last um, expansion to the Matilda. Which, of course, is our handgun. Let's head into the cannons. I'm gonna switch. We equip the Matilda once again. There's a few dogs. You need to kill. Once they're still in the cage. Shit. 
Okay. No. This is the morgue. All we need from the morgue is... Not this one, sorry. This one. There's a flash grenade here. And also, on the other side, I believe it's this one. find the key. This is the first circuit. We need to find two in total to restore the power. The other one is in the clock tower. This is where we put the generator on. This is not restoring the electricity, by the way. When I leave that dog there... And... Getting out of here. There should be a dog coming this way. He always gets me. Oh, come on. I'm not using me. Okay, so now we have a choice. Either go for the Matilda and fight three more dogs. I'm going for. Okay, fuck them. I still have some life left. I'm back in the station now. Thing is, we don't have any hair. Uh. 
<sighs> so probably yes, this video is coming to an end very very soon. This for now, we actually don't even need this. Son of a bitch. Fucking die, please. Jesus. Head off. So I have to cut through here now. Okay, luckily here there should be, yes. So our life is fully restored once again. Cool, now. Um, should take that one with us. Go up again here. I forgot the book. Apologies for that. I need to backtrack a bit. We need that. To get the magnum later on. So the fastest route is this way. Sorry for, for the backtracking there, I just forgot the book. Through here, through here. You combine the book with the arm, and then use the arm. That should give us the spec there. Now 
if we examine this spec there, we just need better jewel. That's it. No. Yeah, I'm not going to bother. dealt with. There should be a second one over here. Should be a police officer. Two spaces, two winter spaces. We don't need that. This door is closed, wrong door, sorry. Some shotties, which is always good to have. And now, we go on the roof. Well, it's not actually the roof, it's a terrace. Okay, so, ammo over here. We need to get down here. To turn the leaf, basically there's the helicopter there, there's the pipe, we need to turn it and then turn on the water. This is where we find the key. There's four keys in total in this game. I'm removing the jewel. I'm removing the 
best grenade. And I'm disposing of this tulip here. Jesus Christ! She stepped on her feet. fighting him for the time being, so just gonna lure him out, take a wide corner, go in, run past him, go down here, take the shortcut, See you later. Now that we have the key, we need to open a room down here, which is tricky. Because now the enemies spawn. There's liquors here, so we go in, we go out. Wait until the music fades. And then go in. And the liquor is not there anymore. Take that guy out. Take the hand grenade and we take the jack. Can't open this door now. You can see you can hear Mr. X coming. Just wait for him here. That's why I killed the zombie coming in from the window. Just we can have a clear escape room now. So now, immediately, off to the library. We're gonna use level 2. some time here. Now Mr. X use the jack. We push everything to the right and we should be okay. No, we're not. And ah, shit. We're fine then. We are fine. This might be the end of this episode, guys. We feel I'm dying soon. Where you going, man? Yeah. Quick, 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 quick. Ooh. Okay, 
Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We have lost a lot of time now. He will be on our ass. This video is going to be long. Now, the staircase is here. It's fine. We'll go up here. We will change the cog. We'll take one and replace it with another one. Fuck, I forgot to get it. I forgot to pick it up. Sorry about that. <sighs> we had to pick this one up again. Apologies for that. Go up here, we change the frog. Put that one in. Then we go down again. And use this one here. And this will give us the second circuit breaker. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. There is one large gunpowder here, which I want to take. And uh, I'm gonna leave this episode here, guys, because it's over an hour and 15 minutes already. So, yeah, let me know if you want to see another part. Maybe in the second part, we're gonna finish the game, I don't know. Just let me know. Um, if you wanna see more, just press that like button, subscribe to Jamie New. My name is Zuri, and thanks, and stay safe. Bye bye.